The overall goal of this fluorescence-based assay is to detect the presence of toxic unchelated gadolinium ion in aqueous solutions containing magnetic resonance imaging contrast agents. This method can help facilitate the gadolinium-based MRI contrast agents by providing a means to ensure high parity of synthesized agents. The main advantage of this technique is that it is able to detect submicromolar concentration of unchelated toxic gadolinium with relatively high selectivity over other biological metal cations. To begin this procedure, prepare the assay buffer as outlined in the text protocol. Using sodium hydroxide and hydrochloric acid, adjust the pH to 7.4. Then, filter the buffer through a sterile disposable bottle top filter with a 0.2 micron PES membrane. Next, transfer 497 microliters of the assay buffer to a fresh microcentrifuge tube. Add 1 microliter of prepared gadolinium aptamer stock solution and 2 microliters of prepared QS stock solution. Transfer 50 microliters of this 2x gadolinium sensor solution into each of 9 PCR tubes. After this, place the tubes into a thermal cycler. Set the thermal cycler to heat the samples to 95 degrees Celsius for 5 minutes, then slowly cool the solutions to 25 degrees Celsius over 15 minutes. It's important to remember to heat the 2x gadolinium sensor solutions to 95 degrees, followed by slow cooling to room temperature before adding the gadolinium ion solution. To begin, dissolve.